Eid al fitri 2022 in the UAE is announced. Remember, the decision was announced by the Federal Authority for the Government Huma, uh, Human Resources and Emiratization. This is uh, the, the government, this is the government uh, sources authority that is responsible for, for, for announcing such kind of public qualities in the UAE. Uh, but according, when you look at that, according to the federal government or according to the federal authority uh, for the government, that is the government human uh, humanization resources, uh, the it is likely to, to form, to, to have its break from the Ramadan, that is on 29, uh, to Sharo, that is our third. Meaning that in case there is uh, the UAE Moon Sighting Committee, convened to confirm the official starting date of the Eid at that say. That means Eid is likely to follow on May 2nd as per the astronomical cal uh, calculations. In case the moon is sighted at that time, then probably we, 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 we definitely have to expect or we expect that Eid should be, Eid will be falling on, on what you call uh, May, as per the astronomical uh, uh, calculations, remember, according to the official UAE, uh, UAE she, according to the uh, according to the official circular or according to the UAE laws and rules, um, all workers or all residents in the UAE uh, have to be given what you call uh, days off, or what you call paid days off. What we mean is they being days off, days being off, but you are not paid. And there's what you call days off, celebrating those days off that are being paid according to the law or according to the Ministry of Human uh, Humanization uh, and Immigration in the UAE. They are supposed to be given off, but they are again supposed to be paid fully because it is they say, uh, celebrated. You know, remember, the, remember this is an Islamic calendar that we get celebrated that uh, marks the end of the holy month of Ramadan in the whole world. But according to the official UAE holiday list, uh, residents will have Eid al fitri that is from uh, Ramadan 29 uh, to Shalwa 3rd. And if Ramadan lasts for 29 days, that means residents will have to get four days off. And if the holy, and, and if that means, and if again uh, Ramadan lasts for 30 days, then that means the residents and all residents and, uh, and, 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 and nationals in the UAE will have to get what you call five days off. Hope you're trying to get it clear. It is actually now, and they are believing actually that the astrophysical calculations believe that it may be on May, uh, what you call May, starting May 2nd. But again, we are looking at a situation that in case we, uh, in, in case the calculation or in case what after the moon sighting, what, what is being announced that it falls on the last Ramadan month, uh, last Ramadan date, which is 29. That means by the calculation uh, that um, all residents in the UAE will definitely get four days off. But it, if, it, if it definitely falls, if it definitely falls on what you call uh, 30th, of April, then that means all residents in the UAE will have to get five uh, days off break, and those days are actually played both, uh, both on what you call the private and both what you call the public sectors. They are all entitled to those days at one moment of time. But remember, we say that this year's Eid, we are so much likely to see that is falling on a weekend, which is Saturday and Sunday, meaning that more days will be added for, for especially people in um, the public sector to enjoy, to have more time uh, with their families and celebrate, giving them a nine days, uh, what we call a nine day uh, holiday at all the same. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. By the way, if it's your first time to come across this channel, consider subscribing. By the way, don't forget to hit that notification bell because it's very important for you to be updated for you to get that notification when we upload a new video. Remember, it's mixed from the mix creation. See you again in the next video.